टूडे वी लर्न हाउ टू कैलकुलेट बॉन्ड ऑर्डर बॉन्ड ऑर्डर मीन्स शॉर्टकट टू कैलकुलेट बॉन्ड ऑर्डर फर्स्ट वट इज बॉन्ड ऑर्डर सो बॉन्ड ऑर्डर इज टोटल नंबर ऑफ बॉन्ड्स बिटवीन टू पर्टिकुलर एटम्स फॉर एग्जाम्पल वी हैव नाइट्रोजन इन नाइट्रोजन यू नो ईच नाइट्रोजन नीड हाउ मेनी इलेक्ट्रॉन्स थ्री मोर इलेक्ट्रॉन्स बिकॉज एटोमिक नंबर ऑफ नाइट्रोजन इज सेवन and to complete its octet nitrogen needs three more electrons so nitrogen and nitrogen form three bonds between two atoms so bond order of n2 is 3 and there is a rule that all isoelectronic species have same bond order now in nitrogen you know atomic number of nitrogen is 7 so number of electrons in one nitrogen is 7 so in n2 number of electrons 14 that means all the at molecules or ions having 14 electrons diatomic molecules and diatomic ions having 14 electrons have same bond order that is 3 and one thing more you have to remember that if number of electron is 14 bond order is 3 now you go up means 15 16 17 18 19 20 if you go down means 13 12 11 12 13 bond order is 3.3 when it a number of electrons are 14 you know 15 it is 2.5 16 it is 2.0 17 it is 1.5 18 it is 1.0 19 it is 0.5 and 20 means 0 0 means there is no bond if number of electrons in a diatomic molecule R twenty. Now same when we go up thirteen means two point five twelve two point zero then eleven one point five ten yes one point zero what about nine zero point five. and if it is 8 it is 0.0 so keep in mind this one 14 and for every electron subtracted or added we decrease the bond order by 0.5 14 to 13 14 to 15 both have 2.5 2.5 now come to this Uh, for example, we have beryllium two. Now, what is atomic number of beryllium? Four. So, beryllium two means total electrons eight. So that means bond order is zero. That means no bond between two beryllium atoms. So, what would we say? Beryllium two. does not exist now come to b2 yes number of electrons 5 plus 5 10 because atomic number of boron is 5 so 5 plus 5 10 10 is number of electron you know and we know that atomic number is equal to number of electrons in a neutral atom so total is One, because number of electrons, just write down number of electrons, eight, ten, C two, twelve. So it is two. N two, just we have discussed, fourteen. That is three. N two then, O two, sixteen, means. Two, F two, 
is bond order is 3.5 this is an exception because in when co positive is formed from co electron is removed from sigma star 2s yeah, according to molecular orbital theory now with this bond order we can compare bond lengths what is the relation between bond order and bond length? Bond order is inversely proportional to bond length. More the number of bonds, smaller is the bond length. So if we compare and it is also proportional to stability of molecular species. So if we compare O2 positive, O2, O2 negative and O2, 2 negative. See, bond order, what is the order of bond order? It is 2.5, 2.0, 1.5 and 1.0. So what about bond length? Bond length. As bond order of O2, 2 negative is least, so its bond length is maximum. So order is like this. 
O2 positive has least bond length and O2 2 negative has bond length maximum. So the, in this way we can calculate bond order, we can compare bond lengths in MCQs, in objective questions. Thank you.